Which books are people trying to ban in schools? We wanted to find out. KHOU 11 investigates surveyed the 10 largest districts in Greater Houston. Cheryl Mercedes joins us now. Cheryl, what have you learned? Well, Len Mia, not only did we learn what books were reviewed, but we learned what books are actually banned in some districts. But here's the thing. Some of the titles allowed in one district may be banned in another. Books once accessible to students across the greater Houston area are now banned from some school libraries. Good evening. Haiti ISD students are pleading with the school board to bring them back. I shouldn't have to continue this fight for six months to see an overwhelming number of book challenges. This school year, KDISD removed 10 books it deemed pervasively vulgar from its school libraries and classrooms, more than any other district. Students like Jordan High School sophomore Zara Bachran says it puts Hello. some students at a disadvantage. School libraries are one of the primary sources for literature for a lot of students. KHOU 11 investigates asked the 10 largest school districts in Greater Houston for a list of books they reviewed. We found 81 challenges to 62 books this school year. The books ranged from LGBTQ novels and suspected critical race theory books to the Bible and a biography of Donald Trump. This is a culture war against LGBTQ and BIPOC students. Seven Lakes High School senior Cameron Samuels and Jordan High School junior Allison Franks hope to change that. In February, as part of an event called Freedom Week, they distributed hundreds of copies of books under review. A lot of them were actually books I had read that really shaped me or had an impact on me. I just felt like what's going to happen if we ban these books and then it spirals. KDISD had the most books banned of the 10 school districts we surveyed, followed by Sci Fair, Clear Creek and Klein. Only four of 10 districts surveyed banned books. Five of Katie's removed books were reviewed by other districts but allowed to remain in school libraries. Sci Fair and Klein also banned one book each that was kept at other districts. I formally challenged this book. Mary Ellen Cazell, a mother of three KDISD students, has spoken in favor of restricting books. If we put these books up on a movie screen, these movies would be rated R or NC-17. Is this an LGBTQ issue? Emphatically, no. It is all about keeping sexually explicit, vulgar material away from minors that don't need it. But these students say the books simply reflect their realities. Well, I understand where these parents are coming from, but at the same time, these books aren't pornography. They're not like erotic or anything like that. It's just a story. KDISD declined our request for an interview. They instead sent us a link to the district's book review process. As for the districts that did not ban books, three of them, that's Houston, Aldine, and Pasadena, all said they didn't get any complaints. Fort Bend, Umble, and Conroe received complaints, but have not removed any books. Len? All right, we have talked about a lot of books here. On KHOU.com, we have an interactive graphic with all the school districts we surveyed, as well as the books as the books they reviewed, restricted, and banned.